Hey, this is Suze B and again we're at the BSN stand and I'm joined by India who has some fantastic news from last night and two weeks ago. Can you tell us about that? <laughs> um, I, I won the Arnold Classic Miss Bikini International in Ohio two weeks ago and I last night I won the Arnold Classic in Australia Bikini Division. So I am, I mean, <laughs> I'm going to be processing this for a little while. <laughs> I believe so. Now, what I think is really most fantastic about that is so you've made changes to your physique that have really attributed to this success, but what I find really interesting is you actually prep yourself, is that true? Yes, I do. Um, I do. And I have been doing it now for a couple years. Um, you know, I wanted to, I, I got, okay, so I guess I got to give you a little backstory so you understand. Um, when I first started competing, I was a little girl, I was like 90 pounds, little boy body, which I still, you know, I have a little boy body, <laughs> but um, it's better. Uh, and um, I got to a point where I, well, I was overtraining, under eating, and so my body stopped responding. And I had to figure out, well, this isn't cool, what am I gonna do? So with a lot of patience and learning my body and learning what works for me, um, you know, I was able to move past that. My body's finally normalized itself, which is so amazing. And uh, Again, I just, through that process, I learned what works for me. Um, and of course, keeping my mind in a peaceful place, balanced, healthy, goes a long way. So, um, yeah. <laughs> and that's really fantastic, actually, because you find a lot of people that are successful aren't willing to sort of draw strength from making mistakes here and there, but that is all part of the process. And how do you how do you use that? Because you prep quite a lot of clients online and you, you said something very interesting that you actually do a holistic style coaching, um, mind coaching. Did you want to discuss that a little bit more? So I'm a, I'm a master life coach. Um, I, I love what I do. I, you know, being able to help people find themselves Girls who have eating disorders, eating issues. Um, I mean, I, even men, when it comes to the life coaching, I just love helping people come out of what's holding them back from being able to accomplish the goals that they want. I want them to find happiness. I want them to find that peace that they deserve to feel. And um, I get chills talking about it because I, I just, thinking about my clients, it's just, it's, it's, it's such, it's so rewarding for me. And I incorporate that into my online training. I do a little bit of that. Um, my business is called Bloom Through Coaching, um, and the website is www.bloomthroughcoaching.com, and that's where I offer live coaching sessions and also the online training for female bikini competitors and PCI FBB. I make sure to incorporate the live coaching into the online plans because some of these, if you're a competitor, you know how much of an emotional roller coaster this sport can be, and so you need to make sure that your mind is in the right place. Just period, because life goes on, it's not just the stage, so. <laughs> now, so you've been on stage in Australia now. What would you say is your favorite part of being in Australia? Do, do you love being on this side of the world? And what, what have you seen here that you love the most? I love Australia. I loved Australia before I came to Australia. And I've been coming now um, five years and the, the, just the energy, as soon as I get off the plane, I could be so tired, but the energy here is so strong and warm and it's just good. And I love it. I love being around everybody here. Everybody's so nice <laughs> and, um, you know, welcoming. I, I just love being here. It's a great place. Now, finally, for people that want to follow in your footsteps or they just don't know where to start with training, girls or guys, what's your number one motto or tip for them to keep in mind that will make the biggest difference? Don't hold yourself back. <laughs> yeah, they, we do it. Sometimes when things are going wrong or you can't get out of like a funk or whatever, just stop for a second and think about it. Well, what is really holding me back and why? Is it me? And what am I doing? Why am I holding myself? What am I afraid of? Um, it's all us. And we, we like to look outside, but we need to look at us ourselves first. Wow, that was really fantastic. That was really deep. Th thank you so much for chatting to us today. Thank you. And thank you, PSN. I love being here. You guys got to stop by the booth. <laughs>